My name is Justin Maskulinski. I'm a sports reporter and I have been with the News and Tribune for six months. So a sports reporter basically watches sports and writes about them. It's a pretty cool gig. I, uh, there's been many days where I spend over half of the day watching sporting events, so really can't complain there. Uh, day to day it's really different. I think that's what I like about it the most. Uh, there's really not two days that are exactly the same. Back to back or really all together. I mean, usually I'll come in about 3.30 and then uh, put together briefs, which are all of the little things, events happening around, uh, like right now basketball polls or something that we try to update every week. Uh, then from there, if I have a game to cover, I'll head over there with basketball. I've learned that you have to get there pretty early because people like basketball in Indiana quite a bit. So I'll go from there, cover the game, tweet during it. At halftime of a game, I'll write usually the first half of the game. I'll write that part of the story. Then after the game, it's me scrambling around to try to find coaches, players, and then either writing from the gym or going back to the office and then I'll help with editing other stories. If sports editor Greg Mengelt is not in that day, I'll proof the pages, but usually when I have to proof pages, I'm not covering a game. So there's a lot going on in an eight hour period and it keeps me moving around and I like that. My favorite sport to cover is actually ice hockey. There's not a lot of it around here. I covered some of it in college at Miami University. They got a good hockey team. I was born in Buffalo, New York, so I cheer for the uh, Sabres, unfortunately. But one thing I found about covering sports is that as soon as I see a storyline or I'm able to sit down and watch a team, I end up loving it no matter what sport it is. So. I say so far, this may offend people, but my favorite sport to cover has been soccer. I really enjoyed following the soccer season, and I'm sure all the Hoosiers will try to change my mind to basketball. I've given a lot of thought, and I think I'm going to go with flying, but not because it can get me places quicker or faster. I show up really early to places as is, whether I'm driving or even walking. I show up to places way too early. But I like, when I'm on a plane, I like looking out the window. So I think being able to fly would give me some cool views around the area. My perfect day, my first thought of this would be that it'd be the middle of June and the Sabres would be winning the Stanley Cup, but that doesn't really seem possible in my lifetime. So uh, I'm gonna go with just a day that at the end of it, my face hurts from smiling and laughing so much. Um, you can fill in the blanks in between. The thing I love most about working for the News and Tribune is the passion of our readers. There's two main reasons for that. The first one is it gives me a job. If we didn't have readers, I probably wouldn't be working. So that helps. And uh, the second reason is when I mess something up, I'm new to the area, I've only been here six months, so when I mess something up, there's usually somebody emailing me to tell me about it or reaching out on Twitter. So a lot of the times, if I do something wrong, I don't usually know about it unless somebody calls me out on it. So I actually do like that readers are able to keep me in check. <laughs>